Hello guys again in this video we will talk about splash screen in Flutter. You can add splash screen manually or using packages. They are the two most common ways to do this. The first way. Go to VS Code and add the image of the logo you want in splash screen. For example, I will add the channel's logo. Copy the path to the image, we will need it later. Create a splash screen dot dart. This way is very common, but it is not the best. Now we create a stateful widget. The reason I call stateful is because I need an init state function. Import material dot dart. I will replace container with scaffold. And I put the logo image in the center widget. Here you can control the shape of the image. Here I will change the background color to a distinctive color, and you can modify many properties. Use the init state function, and inside it I will call a private function go to home. Now we create a go home function that will run automatically when splash screen is called because it exists inside init state. We add ascends because it is a value that will be returned future function. The delayed function has the primary task of delaying execution to the time you have previously chosen. For example, I will choose 2000 milliseconds, which is equivalent to 2 seconds. Two thousand milliseconds is when the splash screen appears. Here, after two seconds, it will be moved to the AK test page by navigator. Push replacement. Do not use push, but rather use push replacement in order to ensure that the user does not return from the home page to the splash screen. Added cons to improve performance. To see the final result, I will run the project. Sorry, I forgot to call splash screen, and I will try again. It actually worked. The second way. Go to a browser and search for the Flutter native splash package in pub.dev. Install the package. Copy the path of the image you want to place in the splash screen. Now I will create a flutter native splash.yaml file. Go back to your browser and copy this code and paste it here. We see many properties, including background color and image path, for Android and the web, and many more properties that we can control. I will change the background color and then the background image. The image path must be forward slash.
Uncomment. Cure for Android and iOS and Web. There are many options you can take advantage of to create an attractive splash screen. In the final step, we copy this command and write it in terminal. Goodbye to white screens. It actually worked. To see the final result, I will run the project. It's not pretty but it works. Thank you for watching. I hope the video is useful. See you next week.